U.S. dollar continues to find buyers on dips. Before we start, a word from our sponsor. This video is brought to you by XNS, the world's largest retail broker offering ultra-fast execution with no overnight fees. Find a link in the description below. The U.S. dollar initially fell against the Japanese yen during the trading session on uh, Thursday, but at this point, the 155 yen level continues to be massive support, and we have seen that play out uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. The 50-day EMA is hanging around that area, and that is a technical indicator that a lot of people will be paying close attention to anyway. Now, keep in mind that we have the jobs number coming out of the United States on Friday, and that will cause massive amounts of volatility i think at this point anytime this pair pulls back you have to be looking at it as a buying opportunity the 158 yen level above is a massive barrier that the bank of japan has put in place due to their intervention but really at this point in time if we break above there and i do think we will because of the interest rate differential this pair will eventually go looking to the 160 yen level if we break down below the 50-day EMA, then the 152 yen level is a massive support level. And then eventually the 150 yen level where the 200-day EMA is and basically where I defined the overall trend. So with this, I'm a buyer of dips and quite frankly, I hope it falls so I can buy more. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe.